Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. We are doing a couple videos today to catch up on our birthday entries. I want to apologize to these two ladies. I've had these a couple days, but with work, I have not been able to craft, to do anything in my craft room. Um, it's just been a really, really tough week. And uh, yeah, so I want to say that I am sorry to both Lasagna and um, Sherry Moore, Miss Ebony. So they are the last two entries for the birthday challenge this year. We are going to go ahead and get into it. Uh, I'll film these two videos, upload them probably um, back to back, and then that way tonight I can draw the winner so that we aren't waiting anymore. seen that. That is a really cute, um, it's actually a hair bow, but she has zhuzhed it up. So cute for packaging. Oh, thank you. I don't have this color. Um, this is Sunlit Meadow Nouveau Glitter Drops. Super cute. Oh, and then she sent... Lasagna, did you make these? I'm wondering if these are resin and you made these. Wow. I would be hard-pressed not to use these as hair bows. I could still get away with it. <laughs> oh, I love them. Thank you. Well, now I gotta go stalk your channel and see if you were making these. And then she shared some of the sequin trim in the gold and silver. I don't have any silver, but this is handy. I can just keep this on my desk and use it um, straight out of the little thing instead of having to carry over the big rolly cart. I love these. Now I'm curious. I'll have to go and check your channel for sure. Okay, and then to the embellishment box that looks like a book. This is amazing. Love by Lasagna, Miss Stahl's Handmade Creations. If you guys are not following her, I would be really surprised because she's amazing. Ooh, it looks like an Anna Griffin card. Oh gosh, these cards are so pretty. Happy birthday, my dear friend. And she left it blank so I can reuse it. I hope you have the best birthday ever, my friend. Enjoy it to the fullest. I wish you much joy and success in all your endeavors. Hugs, Lasagna. It's blank, so you can reuse the cart. Thank you. I will definitely hang on to that and use it. I'm sure there's a birthday coming up. Okay, and then this, you see the gold, um, looks like the book pages. I don't want to say this is Hey Pumpkin, another collection I did not ever get my hands on. But this cute haunted house ribbon. Oh, how neat. Such a cool presentation. So 
really cool. I'll definitely keep that. I'll keep this together. And then she put... Oh. She covered this piece of paper with the Dollar Tree trim and made it a shaker. There's another one of those really cool 3D um, rosettes. Some of the Tim Holtz words and some jewels. It wouldn't be a project if it didn't have some bling on it by Lasagna. Oh, how cute. And you know I love the Halloween. So, I feel like there's some sequins coming out a little bit. Okay. So we have some stickers. Those are really cool. Ooh, look at these. Little skeletons. Super cool. And then we have, what is this? Embossing powder by Nuvo. I've never tried their embossing powder. It's called Crimson. And we have lots of um, garment pins. I love these. I only have them in black though. So thank you for sharing. Then we have this really cool oh, macaroni. Did you wire wrap this? That is so cool. It's a little wire wrapped bead. Love it. And then some more of the little flat pumpkin beads. And here we have some of the um, flat back bows in the fall colors. We have some little flare buttons that have sticky backs. So we have a, a runaway bat. Love these. And then we have some bells. I don't think I have any of those. Lots of little, um, I think these are the Tim Holtz, the flat back um, roses. Then we have some that are, they have the bell on them, but they have a tiny, tiny little gold bauble there. And some black ones. And they also have a little gold doodad. And I see some sequins have escaped. Then we have two acrylic pumpkins, perfect for assemblages. We have the tiniest, I don't know how you guys make these super tiny little bows, but super cute. Then we have a sequin mix here with the little clay bits of the half moon. Then we have um, a zhuzhed up clip. Ooh, there's a little Jack Skellington in the sequin mix. A little clay, clay bit. Then we have more of the acrylic spiders that she used throughout the projects. We have a little clip with a bone. Garment pin escaped. And we have, huh, I've never seen these before. These little acrylic bats, they're like the spiders. But they're bats. Super cool. Love, love, love that you went with Halloween. It's hard to put the Halloween crafts away when you start. <laughs> I don't know that that's going to close. She had it in there in such a way. Okay. Maybe that will shut. Nope, we're going to set it right here. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Lasagna. Yours is going out on Monday. I am off work tomorrow. I took a mental health day, 
so I will get all of the slops and mail that I owe out and I will see you guys in the next video with Ebony's um, project share. Thanks.